What's going on? What's going on? Hey, it's your boy Skills. How y'all doing? Alright, what's up? Okay, my name is Willie Jefferson Jr. I write for the Houston Chronicle um, video game blog called Houston Gamer. What I do, I unbox items, companies, PR firms, developers, publishers, like, send me for review. Alright, so, <sighs> so y'all got a chance to play what y'all? What game? That's right. Beyond Two Souls, alright? So, I don't know if you saw my review or not. I really enjoyed it. The controls were a bit sketchy, but overall, it was an awesome experience. My favorite part, okay, here be the spoilers, right? Turn the volume down, and I'm going to do like this, and that's when you know the spoilers off. But look, giving birth in a video game, helping, oh, that was beast. So, all right, so... If you tuned in today, thank you very much for tuning in. Um, I'm quickly blazing the charts, heading towards 15,000 subscribers. Thank you very much. This Saturday, y'all, uh, this Saturday coming up, look for my shout-out Saturday. I'm bringing it back. Um, like I said, y'all are just too good to me. Thank you so much for your comments. Thank you for your likes. Thank you for tuning in. All right, so I know y'all didn't want to hear my mouth flap or anything, but so this is what we're going to do today. All right, right now we're going to talk a little bit about the... Razor Tiamat, alright, 7.1 headphones, alright, this is a review of them, alright, so, like I said, Razor sent these, they also sent the Krakens along for review, and I got a chance to play with them, um, I'm really just blessed to be able to review really nice pieces of premium audio, but, here's the thing, with the Krakens, they're pretty straightforward, um, they're green, I mean, just over the top. They're not so much gaming headphones, but just, you know, really cool headphones to use. And like, like I said, if, you know, you're going to use it with your um, like iPhone, Android, any personal device like that. However, these right here, the TMIs, now these are gaming headsets. Now, here's the issue. They're PC only. Now, do they look nice? Absolutely. Absolutely. Now, how do they sound? Here's the deal, all right? The way you hook them up is, first of all, you have to have an available USB, standard USB, not 3.0, but just 2.0, and you have to have enough jacks for all this spaghetti right here, all right? I know that's a whole lot to contend with, all right? So, what happened is, I have an older Jet Dell unit that I use to edit my video, videos. Hook this up to them. <sighs> now... When you hook it up, you control it with this. Unfortunately, there isn't a, wi a wireless version of this, so that's what you get. And I'm actually going to hook this up, and then you'll see how it looks. But what you can do is you can adjust, for instance, you adjust the volume right here and also on your PC. If you want to mute it, you just press that, like so. And I mean, it's, it's really cool, but the thing is, wired... I much rather prefer wireless, so that's a strike against it. And also, I hooked it up to an older PC. Now, granted, I did hook it up to at least three of these slots, three of the audio um, outputs, and it really didn't get that loud. And I was saying to myself, wow, this is a $180, $200 device, and I'm like, maybe I'm doing something wrong. Well, here's the good news, all right? So I got um, a newer... Acer laptop, 17-inch screen, so I mean, you know, it's LED, it's sick. And I hooked this puppy up, and guess what? They really just came to life. So, if you have a PC that you don't, that you don't do a whole lot with, and you hook these up, you're, you're probably going to be disappointed. However, the way that these are, they're 7.1. What you need to do is, you need to hook these up to a PC or Mac that has surround sound on it. When I hook these up to the Acer, they really came to life. So, I will go ahead and hook them up and show you exactly the beautiful colors that they are. Okay, and we're back. So, I have everything hooked up. You can see the green on it, on the drivers. I mean, that is absolutely wicked. You can also see how this, the actual, this is what you use to mute the mic. You can also just use it, for instance, like, make sure you can use whatever device you have it hooked up to, like if it has another set of speakers, 
and then you can also go with disabling the 7.1 sound. Now, if you're tired, not tired, or you need to silence it for a minute, you can mute that. That also works with the microphones. Now, these particular, right here, these are different inputs. So if you have, for instance, you have it hooked up to a subwoofer or an input, an output that's a subwoofer, what you can do is you can actually adjust the sound right here and you see how the green, how the green bars, and I mean you can also just say, let's say you don't want that much bass in your music or whatever you're listening to. Now, someone had asked me, okay, what about as far as a gaming headset? Now, here's how it works. You pull the microphone down like so, and then, boom, you can adjust it. So, and really cool, all right? So, now, how does it actually sound, all right? So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and play a little bit of this, and let me see if you can hear this or not. You can't hear it, but I mean, the headphones, they fit perfectly over your head, on your, over your ears and everything. And I mean, you see how deep my finger is and the way it goes? And it sounds great. And like I said, the way it fits on your head is like so. So I mean, you see how big my ears are, all right? And it fits over it. And it's good. And like I said, the thing is, if I need to talk... I just press the mute button, and I have it, hey, what's up, homie? Hey, man, you going to bring over the anchovy pizza and the chitlins? Bet. That's what I'm talking about. The oxtails, too? For sure, son. For sure. All right. So, but yeah, overall, like I said, at first I wasn't that impressed, and I'm like, 179 bucks, 200 for gaming headsets. I get a chance to play with a lot of gaming headsets, and that's a real good perk of the job. Now, how does it fit, and does it feel sturdy? Yes, it does. And then when you're finished with your headset, there you go. And you can use them for listening to movies in 7.1. You can also use them for listening to music. That's what I was listening to it for. As far as gaming, definitely. Like I said, but the only bad thing about this is, besides not being wireless, you can only use this pretty much for a PC. You can use this with an iPhone, an Android phone. The only problem is, I mean, it's it's not going to get very loud. So if you want to get your full your full two hundred dollars out of this, then you need to hook it up to a PC. If you're in the gaming, then yes, PC gaming is where it's going to be at. Unfortunately, there are no adapters for using it with the Xbox 360, Xbox One, PS4, PlayStation 3. All right, and I mean that's it. It doesn't have any wireless capabilities, which is really a shame because these are some really nice, I mean, the, looking at the drivers, even though I don't see them, but the people, when I, when I have them on, they can see them. So, the Tiamats, they, these are the Tiamats from Razer. Thank you very much for sending these in for review. So, do I recommend them? Yes, I do. All right. I definitely, definitely, de definitely recommend them. These are really nice headphones. I mean, they fit well on your head. They're excellent for PC gaming. Like I said, I use these a lot whenever I am working on anything dealing with my laptop, anything dealing with my higher end PC. But the one that I edit videos on, that was just a train wreck. And I actually, seriously, that had me thinking to myself, wow, for 200 bucks are these really worth it? But now I can say yes. These are awesome. They'll fit on your head, for on your ears for hours. These are some really awesome cans. Okay, so anyway, just wanted to thank Razor very much for sending this in for review. So. Alright. Like I said, it fits really good, alright, so. Alright, anyway, it's your boy Skills. You know where you can find me. I'm coming right back at you with, guess what? another another headset review so these are going to be really really cool as well all right anyways your boy skills talk to y'all later deuces oh i almost forgot you know you can find me all that information ad should be right here boom click below the ad you know you can get at me hit me up at houstongamer.com that's that's where you're going to see all my stuff you'll see my beyond 
Two Souls review, also my Grand Theft Auto 5 review, other whatnot, you know, like my writing and everything. You can also hit me up on Twitter at M4DSK11Z or at Houston Gamer, all one word. You can also hit me up on my Facebook fan page. Like I said, all that information, boom, below the ad. Click there and then you're good to go. All right, anyway, it's your boy Skills Talk. Y'all later. Deuces.